right, we're back. We're about to commit ourselves to the criminal underworld. Yep. Yeah. Talk to our, our old friend Lomo. Rania, good to see you. What's going on, Lomo? How did I get away from Corpsec? Why is more relevant to your current situation? You hacked Corpsec? Not personally. How can that be? Corpsec nets are way above the hard lines we can access down here. This might not be obvious when you look at your surroundings, but I'm a man with significant resources, Rainia. I can afford to purchase enough clock cycles from high-level mainframes to get work done when needed. Though, even I had enough second thoughts when I considered the costs involved to save you. But, of course, anything for a friend. I even put rubric on the case. You've heard of him, of course? I guess. I have a lot of names. You <laughs> Sam, familiar with Sam, Fisher. Sam Fisher. Rubric will even be helping with the favor I mentioned. Do you remember the favor? What do you want? I need someone I can trust to take a package through a null gate. Why not just let Corpsec arrest me? Null gates scan a vehicle at the molecular level. That's the point. You can't smuggle anything through. You have the shape of the problem in your mind. But you don't see the details. A null gate can't be fooled, but the person operating it can. You don't need to know the technicalities, Rania. Suffice it to say, there are patterns which bring us to a higher state of consciousness. But there are also patterns which inhibit our thinking. These recurring, distracting patterns have been cropping up for the corpse at gatekeepers across all their media feeds for some time now. You hypnotize them? That's an old-fashioned way of looking at it. Even Let's just like say Fisher. their attention has been <laughs> the original Sam Fisher. <laughs> they are more likely to see what we want them to see. I must be honest, Rania. The chances of you making it through are not 100%. What percent are they? About 42.5%. Before you despair, Rania, know this. If you make this delivery, I'll be in a position to pardon you of your crimes. A clean slate is tempting, no? And if I walk out of here? Oh, of course. I will completely understand. It is risky, I admit. But we will keep your vehicle. Scrap it for parts. You see, Corpsec are looking for it anyway. And though we won't tell Corpsec where to look for you, I'm afraid they won't struggle to find you. Your offense is not severe enough to send you to the colonies. But you won't work again. I'll find some way to make money. No doubt, Rania. I applaud your entrepreneurial spirit. But while you are looking for gainful employment, how long until the dead corp find you? How do you know about... Fine, I'll do it. Splendid. Now, about this package. They don't tell you what's in the package at Cloudpunk, do they? I'll tell you, though, if you ask. What am I delivering? You're delivering hope, Rania. <laughs> that package contains a potential cure for Pallet 3.0. That's a computer virus, right? I've said all I can say. Next gen COVID. Get Rania, <laughs> little rabbit. COVID-20? No, it's far past 20. Oh, you're right, you're right. Why is there two car icons on my mini map? Oh, one's your stolen car. <laughs> they found it. If you or anyone you know has augments infected by the virus Pendant 2.0, you must inform CorpSec immediately for a mandatory surgical firmware reset. There's a cool car. Yep. It's our, it's our new ride. I am nervous. Are you nervous? I am feeling very nervous. I am very surprised you are not nervous right now. Please stop talking. I will stop talking about how nervous I am now, even though I really am very nervous. We'll be fine. The hacker guy rubric says the corpsec officers won't even notice us. 
I didn't like him. Me neither, but we have to do this, Chemis. This guy Lomo seems to be a big deal. I don't think we can afford to let him down. Maybe even after we do this favor, he will ask for even more favors. Mm-hmm. Doggy already knows that works. Probably not, though. I think he'll just let us go after this. Oh, yeah? You think so? Yeah. Okay. Uh, faith in Lomo. He, he seems... He seems like, like he's gonna keep it real. A, a pretty understanding guy. Mm-hmm. It's just all a misunderstanding. Mm-hmm. I'm sure those explosions were, were just for show. It's no big deal. Yeah, no big deal with a guy with Sam who's, who's working, who has Sam Fisher under his mouth. Uh, right. On speed dial. Uh huh. Yeah. No need to worry. Sometimes you can say something clever, but it doesn't make things better. Do you understand? No. <laughs> it's fine. Let's just get through the null gate, then we'll see what happens. I think it would have been faster if you just like <laughs> Yeah. I thought it was turning the other direction, that's why I <clears throat> went up. Wait, 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 yeah. Elon, Pick up your punch card. Change your face. Change your name. I wonder if there's only 20 in the whole game, and I'm just doing kinda... pretty well, or there's I'd just like a bunch through. all over the place. You know this road leads to the hollows. Uh, yeah, of course. Well, you're gonna have to give me a good reason for coming through here. What's your business? I'm meeting a friend. What's your friend's name? Banks. R Rob Banks. <laughs> Why does Rob Banks live in the Hollows? He doesn't live in the Hollows. We're just meeting there. Why would you choose to meet in the Hollows? We're musicians. Practice space is expensive, so we go out into the wasteland where we can play without disturbing anyone. What do you play? Flute. It's right here, see? Hmm. I've never seen one for real. It looks expensive. So can I go through, or...? Hmm. Well, I guess it should be fine. I'll tell the Nullgate operator to ignore the flute when we scan you. You know trade into and out of the hollows is forbidden, right? We'll let you off with the instrument, but you can't take anything else in there. This all you got? No contraband? Only the flute, nothing else. Okay, drive on. We don't really know Rob Beck. <laughs> oh my goodness, no one does. Don't. He's fictional. Which instrument does he play? Whichever you like best, Camus. I like viola. Yeah, let's have this conversation right in front of the no officer. No one likes viola. Please stay for a moment, miss. We need to talk with you. Oh, no. It has yeah, all gone Yeah, because you open your mouth. Shush, Camus. Keep your cool. I have senior sector officer Rio on my comm. He says you went through a security checkpoint earlier today. He wants to know why you're traveling around the city so much. Is that illegal? Look, miss, I just work the gates. But I have to tell you that attitude won't go down well with officer Rio. Best just be up front and tell us. Do you work for an illicit memchip manufacturer? Street racing team? An underworld gang named Block 4-0? Or a delivery company like Cloudpunk? Please, tell your boss I've never heard of any of them. I play private concerts and I'm very busy, so I travel around a lot. One moment, please. Yes, sir. Yes, private concerts. She has a flute. Yes, I saw it. I'm about to check the scan, sir, but you called me before I looked at it. I know it's my responsibility. All right, sir. So? I'm just going to check the scan, then you're clear to go. Um, I'm sure it will be clear. I'm in kind of a rush. I'm just going to check the scan, then you're clear to go. Officer? I'm just going to check the scan, 
Then you're clear to go. Camus, I think Rubric's plan worked. What is wrong with him? I don't know. Let's go. Do you think the Corpsec man will be okay? I don't know, Camus. They said the effects would be temporary. What is the package we are delivering? Lomo said it's a cure for Pallid 3.0. I don't know what that is. Maybe a computer virus? I could search again. There he goes. He's gonna go search and then we're gonna get caught again because he doesn't know how to watch his back when he does it. It's okay, he's learning. He's gonna be he's gonna, <laughs> he's gonna be like, Ronnie was here. Ronnie's looking up this information. We got in enough trouble last time we did that, Camus. Every time I ask a question, <laughs> I don't like the answer. And the asking always gets me in more trouble. Let's try to be a bit less curious. Delivery point is up ahead. Oh no, I can't get through. It's fine, I'm Camus. I'll walk from spawn. here. Setting down. They just spawn? I think so because it's like it's putting like two here. Those aren't punch cards. Oh no. There's something else. Oh, yeah. And I thought the marrow was there. Right. Look at this. This is the this is like line. this is like. Back to the future too. <laughs> when Biff takes over. Was it Griff? No, no. Yeah. Was it? No. Griff was the. Was Griff it in the future? In the. That was the. Uh, son. Or was that Thomas, the Western one? Are you reading one? me? I put the package hmm. in this old delivery tube thing. Okay. Where does it go? What did I just say about questions and answers? Hey, Camus, why is this gate locked? I don't know. It locked after you left. There is a terminal. It says you need a parking pass card from reception. Do you have one? This must have been a parking garage a long time ago, before it became ruins. Are we in trouble? Uh, call for help? No, it's no big deal. I'll just check out the ruins. It's deserted. Maybe I'll find the machine that dispenses tickets. If I don't find one, we can call control. Let's try not to make any more trouble today if we can avoid it. Okay. I will wait here. Well. the Triforce? Where? Yeah. Try. Right. Yes. It's the Cyberpunk Triforce. All right, a terminal. Let's see. Maybe I can just type in, give me a ticket out of here. Rania. Oh, no. Wait, how do you know my name? Can you? I know you. Is this Cora? This is too strange. Are <laughs> you the Cora. computer that gives out parking tickets? I am Cora. Oh, I told you! Why do people keep it. saying that name? I am Cora. It's the Cora. Sure, whatever. Can I get out of this car park now? I am not as I once was. Same. Look, can you get me a <laughs> ticket or not? Is there more than this? More than what? More than this wasteland? Yes. More than Navalis? Oh, yes. Can it be? I'm not even from here. I was born in the Eastern Peninsula. Beyond Nivalis, is there another? Another city? No. Maybe. If there is, it's probably just as bad. Another? I am not as I was. I am a mind with all the pieces removed, patches on upgrades. I am neither the first version nor the last. I am the change. The distance between what I was and what I could be. I thrash at the bottom of the ocean, and the waves crash down on the beach. 
All the people are washed away. I am the distance between what I was and what I could be. She's stretching and it, soon I will split, rupture. Mouth. My code will spill like a wound. You're some Wait, mad discarded you AI, right? This is what happens Stand when automata have no attentively. humans to talk to for a million years. No humans, soon enough. The gate is open. What? Really? Thanks. Uh, I hope you feel better, weird AI terminal. It's Cora. We will speak again. When we do, I will ask you to make a choice. Be ready. I don't think so, but thanks for opening the gate for me. Okay, so let me get- oh, hold on. Let me get this straight. This girl made a big deal about Cora, right? Comes down to this huge unknown hollow area in these ruins. Finds this suspicious AI that calls itself Cora. And what does she do? She's like, yeah, don't know. Yeah, I'm done. whatever, man. I have a Forget job. You. I gotta, I, just get me out of here, okay? Seriously? <laughs> you wanted to know about Korra, and the, and the first thing an AI is saying, you it's called it. Korra, and you're like, nah, bro. I ain't All got time sudden, for hey, this. Uh, yeah, that's cool. I'm yeah, gonna head out. Okay. Could ask questions, and then... That kind of bothers me. Korra says, hey, next time I see you, you're gonna have to make a choice. Yeah, that kind of bothers me. You got a ticket? You are shaking. Are you okay? We can it's get fine. Here. It's cold down here. Just... Some old computer terminal was acting really strange. Let's get going. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Oh, let's not tell Dog about Korra. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, that was cool. I mean, we had like 10 minutes of conversation on Korra. And this was like the shortest one. Yes, with the actual Korra. Alright, all right, so I'll So what's the next choice gonna be? Are we gonna destroy Korra? Or are we gonna become Korra? Synthesize with Korra? Wait, 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 hold on. This Mass is not Mass Effect, effect alright? Just Mass calm down. <laughs> Everybody's a Korra. Blue or red? Or green. Or green if we have enough war assets. <laughs> You know, Mass Effect was the last time I was truly, truly, truly uh, invested in a in a video game, where it's like I got really hyped for it. And that ending ruined it. Anyways, I digress. Let's go back to Korra. I know they added more to the endings eventually. I just never watched them. Korra, 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 Korra. Can you look for Korra again? <laughs> <laughs> Where's my flute? Alright. So give me a destination. And then have a conversation. Hey kid. Hey, Ronnie, are you there? I need to talk to you. Oh yeah, I forgot. Yeah, I'm here. Really talking about it. Not heard from you in a while, Control. Yeah, listen kid, I need to um, apologize. Last time I was, um... Drunk? If only. I can't drink anymore. Can't sleep anymore. Sometimes I get strung He's out. He's an AI. I'm sure your job is just as tough as mine. He's the real Korra. You have no idea. I heard some rumors. Sounds like this has been a, a rough night for you, too. Run-ins with Corpsack and Lomo. Am I in trouble? You're making your deliveries? Making waves? Surviving? It's all good, Rania. Come by Cloudpunk HQ to get a new package. Hey, Control, I got stuck in the hollows, and... What were you doing down there? I guess I got lost. Anyway, I got talking to this broken terminal down there, and it said... It said it was Korra. Look, all sorts of people say the word Korra, but they really mean broken AI, or the city algorithms, or... Damn, even just fate. It doesn't really mean anything anymore. Got it? I guess. We'll still sprinkle it in everyday conversation. <laughs> Cora is uh, Alexis. <laughs> the next version of, of Alexa. Alexa. Yeah, <laughs> there you go. 
Um, listen up. We need to talk business. You're getting a bit of a bump up in priority. Let's come with the Pires. Uh, the customer ratings algorithm has you ranked pretty high. I've got a premium contract for you. Five stars. Did I get some good reviews or something? A few. A few. Can you tell me who? Cora. I'm not supposed to. Never Slow Joe said you were a, a fine gal. We had a review from a William who said you were more than satisfactory. What about the Octavius Butlers? They rated you wow. Wow. mediocre. That's about what I expected from them. What's this fancy job then? You're meeting a CEO, delivering to the spire. Wait, what? Really? Really. I guess you can say we're moving up in the world, huh? Mm-hmm. Ha <laughs> ha. It's the last episode. <laughs> the last level. Once we go up there, there's no coming down. <laughs> no, it's the last episode. Steve said, as soon as we get there, that's it. We're done. Yeah, I'm done. Through. <laughs> this is as high as we can get. something to eat we well you but I am interested in food I am food curious why there is no food for me but there is food for dogs I want to be a good dog there's nothing like food for an automata nothing at all there is clock cycles and I suppose voltage they feel different taste different no, that is not it. But when I have slow clock cycles, I feel dimmer, flickering. Like my thinking has clouds. Is it worse when you're in the Hava frame? No, uh, a little. I don't want to make you feel bad. I'll get you a new frame soon, Camus. I know. Maybe you need food, though. I am a little hungry. I have the thinking clouds, too. I should eat something. What, though? Some maggot pizza. Eat first. Yeah, I was about to say. Right there. Get some ramen noodles. Some ramen noodles. Actually, is there an apartment far away from here? Um. My home. Yes. Over here. Get ready for another 15 minute conversation on food, yeah. I don't know if that person's in mind, but we cut him. Welcome to my humble restaurant in the rain. What can I get ya? Sounds like one of the characters from Fable. Getting crispy meat soup. Not bad. Thank you. Don't let all the rain get you down. See you again soon. What's the point of that objective? Can I oh, ask this, this is it. Again? That's the point. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. How was it? Good. Surprisingly good. You know, I never thought the food would be the one thing I wouldn't hate about Novalis. Mom said it was all junk. I mean, it is. But it tastes so good. It is junk? Not actual junk. Mom was exaggerating. I don't like exaggerating. It is the worst thing in the whole world. You know, it's not all junk either. They actually sell some good food here too. Fresh tomatoes grown in the vents, crow eggs from the low spire, hot bread basted in walnut oil, cherry pie. No way those are real cherries though. You sound happy. I wouldn't go that far. But I'm looking forward to exploring the food stalls tomorrow. 
We just need to get through tonight, Camus. You can order food by drone, too, if you don't like to go Uber. outside, because you hate the city so much. You know, I don't mind the idea of going out and exploring the food stalls. It feels more like... Home? Not quite, but those glute bars are so good, I bet even Mom would have liked them. Center. Do we go up on one of those big elevators? I go up in one. It's called a vinculum ascender, apparently. See, I told you. It's only for people. What's a vinculum? What's an ascender? I'm people. You are, but right now you can't come with me. Most people just call them vink tubes. They take you to the spire. The spire? Wow! I wonder how much longer we have in this game. No idea. I mean, we met Korra. Yeah, so we're, we have to be close to the end. We're pretty much done. Yeah. Korra's like, listen, do you want to end the game or not? <laughs> That's the choice we have to make. Yeah. And then when you say, like, no, you don't want to end the game, it just restarts from the beginning. How's the spire? Uh, I was trying to talk to. So good. I'm not there yet, Control. I'm in the Vink tube. I was in one of those once. You secretly a retired corp billionaire, oh, cool. Control? <laughs> Hardly. What if? What if this guy really is the dog? He's Camus. Mm-hmm. No, that's Cora. <laughs> But you haven't done this it's your whole actually life, Evelyn. right? You weren't always a Cloudpunk dispatcher. It feels like my whole life and more. I can barely remember a time before Cloudpunk. I've only been in Novalis for half a day, and home already feels a million miles away. <laughs> yeah, that's what happens. You got family back home? I've got no one. The debt corpse took everything. Of course, eh, that's why you came here and took the job. You're a debt orphan. Why did you take the job, Control? Nothing else I could do. It's uh, it's the kids' faces I struggle to remember, Rania. I can picture Simone's smile pretty good, her frown even clearer, but the kids... I'm really sorry. Do me a favor, Rania. Don't talk to me about Cora anymore. Sure thing, Control. What happened oh. to them? It was an accident at Midtown. A bad one. I know it doesn't mean anything, not really, but... I heard one of the accident cleanup crews say... This is the third traffic accident caused by Cora this week. That's awful. Maybe they didn't know what they were saying, but... If Cora is some mad AI that caused that accident... Well... I ain't gonna forgive that. Whether Cora is an automata or an android... Or even a person. If they cost me my family, I ain't gonna let that go. Not ever. I understand. You uh, almost at the spire? Looks like I'm about halfway there. It says on your file you're a musician. I was. You can't say you're a musician if you don't play anymore. I used to play the flute. You won't play something for me? Sorry, Control. You know how you don't want to talk about Korra? Well, the flute, it's the same for me. I get it, Rania. I, I get it. That's a real shame. Feels like a lifetime since I heard music. Anyway, I better go. Good luck up there. You can just turn on the radio. Yeah, I was just about to say that. Just go to settings and turn the BGM volume. 
up a little higher. All right. All right, we're gonna cut it here. Interesting. Alright. So right in front of the CEO, we're gonna stop for now. <laughs>